A young girl's dream of sharing her love of art now is expanding in ways that she never imagined. Yeah, Emma Stump saw the therapeutic value of art supplies in the hospital as she fought a deadly brain tumor. So she created kits and gave those to other kids. It was a spark that started right here on the south side, and now it's going nationwide. It is a big job assembling and delivering hundreds of art kits to hospitals. In this art kit, and they have different art supplies in them for the kids. This work yeah, is Emma Stump's passion. All right. I love sharing, and I want to share this with others. Emma is now 15, and she started years of aggressive medical treatment when she was just seven. Uh, she was diagnosed with a pilocytic astrocytoma brain tumor. Um, she went through 70 weeks of chemotherapy, six weeks of radiation, and she just completed her 24th surgery. I really appreciate it. Thank you. 90% of that tumor is gone. However, regrowth and hemorrhage are real risks. It's very difficult uh, because it's something that never goes away, that you live with every day. She um, is blind in her right eye and no peripheral vision in her left, and her balance is a little off. But uh, other than that, I mean, she's the happiest kid on the face of the planet. Thank you. Thank you. And for that, Emma, Thank in part, you. credits art. It lets you, like, get your all your feelings out, like, on the paper instead of, like, in words. Distributing art to kids was a project that started with her art teacher and grew with funding from a Southside softball fundraiser. And it raised, uh, I think, around $3,000. And that was the beginning. It really, really took off. Since, Emma earned national recognition with a Jefferson Award. In three years, 20,000 kits went to children in 11 hospitals in Indiana, 12 nationwide. It's why Emma says she never asks, why me? No, I mean, it was me for a reason. And as you can see, my reason was this. And now Emma's reach will grow even more. It's at a whole new level now. The cancer support community is adding Emma's art kits to its programming. In a few months time, um, as soon as we can, can get the construction finished, this will actually be Emma's art studio. We have the capacity to grow this um, into a bigger program and keep it going. It had, it had gotten a little big, bigger than a family could handle. Ready? One, two, yeah. three. It makes me feel amazing um, that I'm helping other kids and adults be able to get art therapy. Thank you to everyone who volunteers and please keep donating to help. You yeah, have a good day, okay? You too. Bye. 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 And it helps all these people and kids. It really has been a blessing for the family that they have this new partnership with Cancer Support Community. And check this out. Who knows what could happen next? You know, art therapy is a true passion for Karen Pence. Mm. Karen and Emma have met multiple times, and it's going to be interesting to see where a potential collaboration between these two mm. could lead. Great.